Oh, okay, hey guys, uh, this is process here uh, with another thing that I'm working with the uh, Honda head unit as you can see here. Uh, let me get my phone locked. Yep, okay, so there we go. So now the issue which I found out is that uh, if you depress the handbrake, well, let's, let me just show you here. If you're basically if you depress the handbrake. Let's say I'm watching a YouTube video. Uh, play. Play, okay. So it says, hey, for safety, you have to, um, you can't use this app. So if I put it back up, it works. Put it down, it does not work. Okay, but what it allows me to do is that, um, if I click Navi, it just allows me to use one of these two apps. So either I can use Google Maps or either I can use um, Waze, for example. So yeah. So if you realize, uh, I'm on Google Maps. So if I take out my phone here, yeah, I'm on Google Maps. So if I try to, let's say, switch. Oops, I realized my phone, I'm being switched. But, nope, it does not allow me to do so. Unless, pull out my handbrake, it allows me to do so. So, one way of, for you to fix this is to get the brake cable bypass. A um, couple of videos on how to do it, but I decided to take the safer approach. Okay, that's the engine kicking back up, think my hybrid battery is low. So what I did is basically I modified the phone link app. Um, I'm still working on it, having it packed. Um, so let me just delete my earlier phone link app. Okay, and let me install a new one. So I'll just show it to you in a minute. Like, um, what's the difference? Uh, you will still get this. It says uh, uh, navigation, but it only allows you to go for navigation app. But hey, um, I'll just show you how to even to get even YouTube to work. So what I'm doing right now is to install. Yeah. Okay. It says it conflicts with the same package. I hope. Oh, okay. I think I didn't uninstall that properly. Let's have it uninstall. Cool. Go to my files. Click that. Low one-time installation. Installing. App has been installed. Okay, just need to grant the permissions. So the way how the app works is that it basically scans all your running application. If it does not match the whitelist, uh, like Waze and uh, Google Map, uh, it will just show you that particular message. Okay, we turn it on. Cool. Restart the app. Phone link. So if you realize, ha, huh, this has been patched. So I just click on start mirroring. And restart the head unit. Start mirroring. Second time should be the charm. Okay, cool. Finally got it to work. Okay, so now uh, handbrake is not on. Okay, so no parking brakes. So I go to phone link. Okay, get this. Press OK. Press Navi. Okay, now if you realize. I have a couple of other apps as well. I mean, I can even go to YouTube. Yeah, yeah. YouTube right now. So, let's say... I search for... Beethoven number 9 here. Um, that screen is horrible, but hey. Okay. Okay, let me just click. See if I can skip. Okay. So if you realize it's playing, 
Handbrake up. Handbrake down just to show you. Up. Down. Okay. So basically, it's uh, it's working. So moment I try to switch from another app, it just goes hey, and I'm able to do that. So basically, what I'm trying to do is to get it a lot of apps whitelisted here. So if you can see, there's Android Auto, there's another app. But just for figure of speech, I decided to include YouTube here. I click back YouTube, launch back YouTube, and I can just continue to play. So basically, uh. I can do this while let's say I'm driving okay not that I'm encouraging you to see videos while driving but um, it will make sense if you have a kid or if you're trying to entertain someone but uh, the whole thing uh, should able to work so uh, if you realize there's a notification that went on just now and <laughs> crazy again I'm gonna click YouTube come back in YouTube so yeah, so um, stay tuned for the APK that I'll be releasing, the modified version of Phone Link. Uh, that's about it. Uh, leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Uh, I know this is going to be a very boring video, but that is just to show that without even the parking brakes and no modification to the console. Uh, you can basically get it to work as is. If you're wondering how am I mirroring, I have another video on that. Um, just look for Honda Jazz, uh, Honda City FL uh, mirroring. I showed how I set it up, but this is more on the modification that I've done to um, to get the display unit to work very nice with, uh, with my phone. Thank you.